So this is how it is common sensely known and educated for every person that doesn't understand what I am speaking about. So first, if you are killing an immortal that is supposedly a universe species, for example, soul element, dead element, death element, infinity element, space element, things like that, and if you alter them, then obviously this affects all life, especially their creations. For example, birds, bees, bugs, animals, whales, or whatever else. Even real humans we are talking about. So if you alter someone that's really big, for example, a reality element, then obviously a bunch of people's realities will be altered and change, shift, or become different. As in terms of a home where you live, and or your appearance and or the creation's appearance. So obviously, this is the common sense, not logical reason why. So if you're going to change a person's appearance to say someone is someone else, then obviously, this is going to affect life. And if you're doing it to somebody that is obviously known as soul element or love element or anything else, you are altering people's soul images. Then you are altering love and love patterns. And you are creating heartbreak and you are destroying infinity. When you are destroying infinity, you are destroying existence. Do you understand? So by shoving an infinity element into supposedly a machine to literally kill a person and our love and or how a person is created to alter and change for you to look better and or to wed someone else's husband is a common sense and logical sense that you are a fucking idiot. And what fucking idiot is that? And which fucking idiot is that? So the question is, are the idiots supposedly out of this machine? Or are they calling through inside this supposed world and machine? When you're hitting karma, killing karma, and killing every single person, what do you think happens when you shove karma into this supposed machine and universe and place of existence? Karma goes around in a circle, cycling in a circle. It's not a number eight. It cycles in a circle until you cleanse it like a MacBook when you restart it. Once you fuck with a MacBook, you're fucking with a computer element. Which is why it's common sense for Notre Dame and things like that to have claim that these things will become no existence. Which is why it's obvious, isn't it? So on a daily basis, you want love to suck your dick all over the place, random fucking people. What does that fucking do? It fucks with Will. If you're fucking with Will, what fucking happens? You one day will do something you regret. And you might not be able to come back from it, could you? So what is a force? What is a... Attacks and what are the uh, threats? You're gonna come around and say these gods are bad. All these gods are bad. All this shit is bad, right? Let's put them on a machine and kill them, right? And then? Who the fuck is bad? Killing people. Forcing people. Running people on a machine, forcing people to do shit against their will. Stomping on people, shit like that. Who? When people try to talk, you press them down and don't let them speak either, right? So do you want to fucking live? <laughs>